Hey everyone, so welcome to my playlist on gate examination questions. So today we are going to solve this question. So this question was again asked in the gate examination which was held in the year 2021. And as you can see the question is based on line integrals. Okay, so I have already recorded one lecture on line integrals. So you can see those lectures. Trust me, it will really help you. So in this scenario, your gamma is the boundary of a square region R. What is the square region? The region joining these four points. Okay, and it is oriented counterclockwise. And I have to find the line integral of a given vector field. Okay, so this is the square we have 2, 2 and 2 comma 2. So this is the square and oriented counterclockwise. So one way to solve this integral, so this if I call this as C1, C2, C3, C4, one way to solve this line integral is you solve along C1, you solve along C2, you solve line integral along C3 and along C4 and you add up. Okay, for each of, for the same vector field, you integrate along all the four curves and you add up, you get the answer. But in this scenario, you can do it in a much more simpler way because the region that the curve C, what is my C curve? This square. The region which this square enclosed is closed and bounded. Okay, so one can directly apply the Green's theorem. Now, what is Green's theorem? So, like if you if you go to my playlist, so on YouTube, when you just type uh, Dr. Metaholic, you will come to my channel, and here in the playlist, once you click on the playlist, at the bottom here you will see vector calculus, and here you can see the line integral. Okay, so once you click on this playlist line student. integral. Here, the session number 6 is on Green's theorem. So, Green theorem says that if you have a vector field F and C is the closed bounded curve in R2, which is simple, then line integral along that closed curve is same as the double integration over R. What is R? It is the region enclosed by the curve C. So, now in this scenario, if we apply Green's theorem, what do we have? So, now first of all, what is our vector field? 1 minus y square and x. Okay, so my f is 1 minus y square and x. So if I do the line integral along the curve gamma f dot dr, that is nothing but double integration over the region R, you do second component with respect to x minus first component with respect to y. And then you do dy dx or dx dy. Now in this case it's a square, so I have to find the limits of x and y. How do you find the limits of x and y? For limits of y, you draw the line parallel to y axis. So y is going from 0 to 2 and your x is also going from 0 to 2. Okay, so whenever you have a square or rectangles, limits are always the numbers, starting point and the end point. 1 plus 2y into dy dx. Correct? Or if you want, you can do dx dy as well. So when I do with respect to x, I have two times integration 1 plus 2y dy okay so now i'm not going to solve this further so just solve this and tell me what is the answer in the comment section thank you